What's up guys, my name's Brandon, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to connect your iPhone to your TV to play content, and also how to mirror your screen to the TV. Now there are multiple ways of doing this, and I'm going to be showing you the three best, most reliable methods in this video. All right, so the first method is via AirPlay. So this is the easiest and most convenient method because it is completely wireless and might not even require any additional hardware. So if you have a 2018 or newer smart TV, you might already have AirPlay 2 built in to your TV. Now, if you don't know if you have that, I will leave a link to all AirPlay 2 enabled TVs down in the description below and you can look through that. But an easy way to check if your TV has AirPlay built in is to just simply turn on the TV and then go to your iPhone's control center, tap right here on screen mirroring, and your TV should show up right there. If it doesn't show up, then your TV does not have this feature and you will need to either use one of the other methods in this video or just buy a Roku or an Apple TV. And I will leave a link to both of those devices down below. Now to stream video from your iPhone to your TV via AirPlay, you need to first make sure that your iPhone and your TV are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Then you just simply want to load up the video you want to watch on the big screen, whether that be from YouTube, Hulu, Safari, or wherever, and then depending Depending on the video player, you'll need to find the AirPlay button. So on YouTube, it's this button right here in the top right corner. Once you tap on that, it'll show you the devices you're able to stream this video to, and you should see your TV or your AirPlay enabled device right here. So just tap on the device and it will start playing on the TV and you will still get access to the video controls on your phone. Now for other video players like Amazon Prime Video and Safari, you will want to look for this AirPlay icon right here. Now you might have to go into full screen mode to see this but once you tap on that you will see the device list and then you just select your TV your Roku or your Apple TV and that content will start playing on the big screen and if you want to mirror your screen to your TV to maybe show your friends some funny text messages to maybe play a video or play a game on the big screen all you have to do is go into the control center and tap on the screen mirroring button once you tap on that your phone's home screen should show up on the TV and you could do whatever you want and it will show up on the big screen and to end the screen mirroring you just have to go back into the control center and tap on screen mirroring again and stop it now the next method is using an HDMI adapter cable so this is a more fail proof method since it works with any modern TV and does not require a Wi-Fi connection however it does require an HDMI cord and this lightning digital AV adapter from Apple so I will leave a link to this down in the description below but those are the only two things you need for this method so the first thing you want to do is plug one end of the HDMI cable into an HDMI port on your TV and then plug the other end into the HDMI adapter. Then you want to plug the lightning cable into your iPhone and change the input on your TV if necessary and you should see your mirroring show up on the TV. You should see your iPhone screen on the TV and you can do everything you could do with AirPlay when you have it hooked up like this. You can watch videos and they'll fill up the whole screen of the TV. It won't just show like the small screen of your iPhone. You can play games even though there is a slight delay so I would not try to play anything competitive and you can pretty much do anything you can do on your phone on the big screen and like I said this method is really nice because it does not require Wi-Fi so if you have a weak connection or no Wi-Fi at all this is going to be the solution for you and the third and final method is going to be the Google Chromecast so this is a cheaper alternative to purchasing an Apple TV or a new TV in general and it's actually what a lot of people use and I used to use in the past now it is going to be about 30 bucks so you can pick this up at your local Best Buy or you can buy it on Amazon I will have a link to that down in the description below but to get started you just want to of course purchase that Chromecast dongle and plug it into your HDMI slot on your TV and then go ahead and download the Google Home app on your iPhone you'll have to enter in a code that you'll see on the TV and maybe do some updates but after that you will see it right there and then you will see the Chromecast icon throughout your iPhone and like the YouTube application Prime Video and Hulu you will see it right there and it will act pretty much just like AirPlay and just like we did with the HDMI adapter so so this will show up and you'll be able to you know run everything through Google Chromecast you could also download things and kind of link them with Chromecast in this section right here so Chromecast is pretty straightforward and you can also do this with a Roku device so if you have a Roku streaming stick it's the same thing so you can really choose between a Chromecast 
or a Roku device. And a few closing things I wanted to mention before the end of this video is number one, you can only stream 4K video via AirPlay. So you cannot stream 4K video if you use the HDMI adapter cable that is only going to give you 1080p quality. So keep that in mind. And also, like I briefly mentioned earlier, if you're trying to play a game on the big screen, don't expect it to run perfectly. There is going to be some stutter. There is going to be a little bit of a delay, regardless of if you use AirPlay or the HDMI adapter cable, it's still going to have a little bit of delay. So I would not be trying to play, you know, Call of Duty Mobile or PUBG or something where you need to be really competitive and have a quick reaction time. Otherwise, you're not going to enjoy it on the big screen. So anyways, guys, there you have it. That is an updated 2022 guide on how to stream videos from your iPhone to your TV and also how to get screen mirroring on your TV. So hope this video helped you out. If it did, I would appreciate if you gave this video a thumbs up and also leave a comment down below letting me know if it helped you out or not. Or if you have another way of doing it, let me know down there in those comments below. And if you're interested, I do also make other iPhone tips and tricks videos here on the channel. So take a look at those and consider subscribing if you like what you see. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching and I'll see you soon.